Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphenate here, and today I'm gonna show you guys how to easily save render presets in DaVinci Resolve. Not only can you have multiple presets with custom settings, but you can also export and import these presets, which is something that I've done across my multiple computers. So it's really simple. Go to your Deliver page. On the left, where you have your export settings, make sure that you select Custom Export. Don't worry about the name or location. Go through your settings as you normally would. So once you've dialed in all your settings, video, audio, file, etc., go to the top right corner of the Render Settings window and click on the three little dots button, which are options, and save as new preset. So I'm gonna call this one 4K 60p 10-bit. Press OK. And now you'll see it save here on the top left corner. So whenever I have another project with the same settings and I want that same render output, I can easily just click on that preset and you can see all the settings adjust. Then go to Add to Render Queue and render. And then if you have variations of that, if you wanna make a different version, just save a different render preset. Now, if you wanna export your saved preset, go back to the three dots options button, find your preset. On the right, you'll see some options. You can update the preset if you make any changes, which will save and overwrite the current settings. Export preset, which will export it as a separate file. So you can email it, put it on a flash drive, copy it, etc. This is what you would do to put it onto another computer or you could delete the preset. Now let's say I didn't have this preset, but I wanted to import it from another computer. I'd either email it to myself, Google Drive, or put it in a flash drive and copy the file into my new computer. Go to the top right corner, three dots options button, import preset, then I'd find the file, click open, and then it would automatically save here as one of my options. So that's how simple it is to save custom presets as well as export and import them. A great thing for me is that I do a lot of podcast clips where I have subtitles. So by setting a preset, I can go to my subtitle settings, export subtitle, burn into video. So I can save one preset with the text and I can save another preset without the subtitles. So I can easily add both to the render queue and export two different versions of the same piece. Now I also have presets where I do audio only. So I actually have one without video go to audio, I have an MP3 preset, and I also have a wave preset. I have a preset with 10-bit, I have a preset for HD 8-bit, etc. Hopefully this video helped you. If it did, please drop a like on this video, drop a comment below if you have any questions, and if you're interested in more DaVinci Resolve tutorials, we do have a playlist on this channel. Thank you guys for watching, I'll catch you guys on the next one, peace.